Welcome back to TEW 2016. I'm here once again for my WWE series. We are here with Monday Night Raw, so let's kick the start night off. Triple H comes out to start Raw and he says, I wasn't supposed to be out here until later tonight. Because I didn't want to wait because I didn't want to give my family a chance to set up an intervention. I want Shawn Michaels to come out here right now. Shawn comes out and he says, we're only looking out for you, Hunter. And Tri Triple H says, Shawn, I challenge you to a match at WrestleMania. Sean says, after Crown Jewel last year, I promised my family I was done for good, Hunter. I can't. Triple H says, what if I put my career on the line? What if I, what if, if I lose, I'm done? What if you can stop me from doing what you and the rest of my family want me to stop doing? Sean then says, I'm sorry, Hunter. Even with that on the line, I can't. Sean leaves. Our next day, Sydney. 73 B minus here as Dean Ambrose will compete against Dolph Ziggler next year on Raw in a 75 B minus match. Dean Ambrose defeats Dolph Ziggler with the Dirty Deeds, but after the match, a B 88 B plus. I was kind of hoping that The Rock would bring this up to an A. Oh well. After the match, The Rock comes out from under the ring and gets behind Ambrose. Before Ambrose no notices what, notice where, notices that The Rock is behind him, he turns around Ambrose and hits him with a rock bottom. He goes outside, gets a chair. Ambrose ducks underneath the chair. A chair shot um, and gets behind the rock and Ambrose gets the cha chair and beats down the rock with it and he then runs up the stage and poses with the Intercontinental Championship in the chair to end the segment with the rock laying out, laid out in the ring. All right, next one, 99A plus as Paul Heyman and Brock Lesnar come out and Hay Heyman says, ladies and gentlemen, let me introduce to you to the heavyweight champion of the world, my client Brock Lesnar. Last week, my client sent a message to Seth Rollins when he ran in and hit him with an F5 after Seth's match. Rollins comes out, before, but before he can, before he gets to the ring, security runs out and cuts him off. And Heyman says, "Seth, Kurt Angle assured me that Brock and Brock that you would get nowhere near him to preserve you from a beating so bad you won't make it to WrestleMania." And Rollins says, "Shut up, Heyman. I don't give a damn about you, Brock." I need you to know your dates with that title are numbered. Heyman says, well, Seth, Brock is an MMA star, and I talked to Kurt Angle, and in the main event tonight, you will compete against another former MMA fighter, Bobby Lashley. Rollins says, Lesnar, I don't give a shit about Bobby Lashley. You just know I'm coming for you. All right, next one. 78B here. Braun Strowman is out before his match. He says, tonight I have a match with Kevin Owens. But I have a feeling that Drew McIntyre isn't very far behind. So no matter who gets in my way tonight, they're going to get these hands. And in an 82B match, Braun Strowman loses to Kevin Owens when he's counted out. Um, fight, Drew McIntyre comes out. Drew McIntyre. Braun Strowman just runs after McIntyre. And McIntyre runs to the back and he's counted out. 86B plus here after that. Strowman is chasing McIntyre through the backstage area. Then McIntyre turns a corner and appears to be gone when Strowman turns the corner. But he's hiding behind one of those production car crate, um, um, one of the things they carry equipment in that has wheels in it. I don't know what you would, I don't know what to call that. I, so I just called it a crate. Anyway, and he rams it into Strowman five times. Strowman's still on his feet, but after the fifth time, Strowman is finally just sitting on the ground against a wall. When McIntyre one last time slams the crate with Strowman laying against the wall before security and doctors finally show up. Alright, next week, an 88B plus. Steph catches up with Shawn Michaels, who's leaving. And Steph says, Shawn Wayne. And Shawn says, What more do you want, Steph? He won't give it up. Steph says, You have to do it, Shawn. Shawn says, What? Sh Steph says, Come on. I know you saw it at Crown Jewel. You were the one that carried that match. You are still the showstopper in the main event, Mr. WrestleMania. You can beat him. And Sean says, that may be, but I made a promise to my wife and kids. And Steph says, Sean, just think about this. Sometimes we need to make sacrifices to save our family from self-destruction. Steph leaves Sean to think. All right, next week, 58 C- matches. Sasha Banks and Bailey defeat Emma and Nia Jax. And after the match, they get on the mic and Bailey says, it has been our dream to be champions together and at WrestleMania we get our opportunity again. Sasha says, We don't we won't make excuses. We failed last time we fought Eo and Kyrie. But this time we'll be different, Bailey then says, and we aren't just gonna say that. We're gonna prove it at WrestleMania. 
Next, a 72B minus as Finn Balor will be competing next against Austin Aries. And a 77B match, Finn Balor defeats Austin Aries. And after the match, the lights go out. Undertaker appears in the ring face to face with Balor, and he's and Taker says, "Finn, I didn't see it before, but I do now." You say the demon is something that comes from the deepest, darkest part of you. But the demon is not a part of you. It comes out in spite of you. And at WrestleMania, I will tame the demon and you will be rid of it once and for all. At WrestleMania, the demon will rest in peace. The lights go out. Taker is gone. And Balor is left in the ring with the demon face paint being projected onto the ring to end the segment. Our next, a 40D minus hype as Cedric Alexander will take on Apollo Crews next. And in a 54C minus match, Cedric Alexander defeats Apollo Crews. And, but after the match, Buddy Murphy comes in and attacks Cedric Alexander. And next week, we will have a, ma a rematch between Cedric Alexander and Buddy Murphy. All right, next, a 84B plus as Vince McMahon comes to Shawn Michaels backstage. And Vince says, Shawn, I think you know why I'm here. I need Triple H to take over for me when I'm done. But he can't do that if I if he gets his head beaten in because he doesn't know when to quit. Sh Sean says, Vince, I made my decision and I'll announce it later tonight. And Vince says, Sean, I've known you a long time. Don't screw me on this. Vince leaves. Alright, 47 D is Beer Money will be competing next. And in a 67C+, plus, they defeat Breezango when um, Rude defeats Tyler Breeze. And after the match, they get on the mic and Storm says, It's a little deja vu when it comes to our match at WrestleMania. And Rude says, It's not our fault that American Alpha can't win keep a winning streak alive. Revival shouldn't be anywhere near this match, but Alpha had to go and lose to lose to him. Storm says, It doesn't matter because we won these titles in spite of the triple threat rules before and we'll do it again. Revival and American Alpha, sorry. About your damn luck. All right, next a 75 B minus as Seth Rollins versus Bobby Lashley is next, and an 85 B plus. I did not expect that good of a match from these two. Seth Rollins defeats Bobby Lashley, and after the match, 88 B plus. Seth is celebrating when Brock Lesnar's music hits. He comes out. Rollins looks ready to go, but Lesnar just circles the ring twice and leaves. All right, next, an 87B+. plus. Shawn Michaels comes out in Triple H. Uh, uh, Shawn Michaels says, Hunter, come out here now. I have a question for you. Triple H comes out and Shawn says, Why? If you don't want to retire, why put your career on the line against me? And Sh Triple H says, Because I want to prove to you I can still do this. And if I can, if, I, if you can beat me, I, don't I know I don't deserve to be in this ring. Shawn says, With that said, Hunter, you're on. But when I beat you, you're done. And if you ever try and come back, I'll make sure to make your life a living hell. And the show gets an 84B+. Plus. There wasn't enough attractive women. I, I didn't do anything with Ronda and Charlotte on this show. Um, but it, it was a good show. 84B+. Plus. Anyway, guys, if you like this video, leave a like, leave a comment, subscribe. Thanks so much, Ken. I'll see you guys next time.